Busy week for Anderson County and Lake Hartwell. The Bass Nation Tournament is rolling into town. Yeah, it sure is. And 7 News reporter Nicole Ford joins us with how this event impacts their economy in a very big way. It's the third and final day for this Bass Nation Tournament as anglers from across the world hit the waters of Lake Hartwell. While the leaves change color and the chill of the wind can be felt across the lake, anglers are spread throughout the water. In this event, there's 47 states and 11 foreign countries represented. Neil Paul with Visit Anderson says these tournaments are boosting the economy for the entire county. And what you've created is a perfect storm for the ideal location for people to come and have a great uh, experience in a community and then a great underwater experience as well. When the anglers come to town, they don't come alone, but rather bring their families who spend more than a week spending their money in the community. They've gone as far out as, as like the Pelzer, uh, area, Belton, Honeypath, Pelzer areas of Anderson County, all the way up to Pendleton, and then also downtown Anderson as well. Uh, they've done everything from uh, museum tours to winery and distillery tours. While this one event is expected to bring in half a million dollars in economic impact, in total, more than $50 million have been spent in the entire county since the opening of Green Pond Landing. Bass will be back in town next month on the 11th for another tournament with 400 anglers in 200 boats. At Lake Hartwell, Nicole Ford, 7 News. Now there still is construction happening at Green Pond Landing to add more parking and improve the facility, but it's on hold while the tournament is underway. Developing news out